Thanks for joining me on episode 1198 of the Inspired Stewardship Podcast. Hello, this is author Nathaniel Garrett Novosel, and I'm here with my friend Scott Mater and his Inspired Stewardship Podcast. We both have a goal of helping people find more meaning and fulfillment in their lives. And if you're interested in developing yourself, others, and using your time more effectively to live out your calling, then please check out his podcast, Inspired Stewardship Podcast. I wanted to clarify too, I talked earlier about motivation. Motivation is an internal feeling. It's something that comes from inside of you that says, hey, let's go do this. Inspiration comes from outside. Inspiration is important as well. This is when you see someone else accomplishing something, you see somebody else doing something important, and you say, I want to be able to do that too. Welcome and thank you for joining us on the Inspired Stewardship Podcast. If you truly desire to become the person who God wants you to be, then you must learn to use your time, your talent, and your treasures for your true calling. In the Inspired Stewardship Podcast, you will learn to invest in yourself, invest in others, and develop your influence so that you can impact the world. In today's episode about investing in yourself by stewarding your time, I talk with you about why consistency is so important. I also share tips on how to be more consistent when it comes to your time, and I talk about how inspiration, motivation, and consistency all work together, but consistency wins. As we talk about stewarding your time, wouldn't it be great if you could support this podcast and do it without just taking too long? Turns out you can't. All you have to do is use inspiredstewardship.com slash Amazon when you're ready to make a purchase via Amazon and a small commission will come back to support the show just that quick. If you enjoy the show when you are ready to buy from Amazon, just use inspiredstewardship.com slash Amazon. Consistency over time is so important to getting anywhere when it comes to using your time wisely. All too often, we have moments of motivation, moments of energy where we get started and get something done, but then something happens and maybe we have a bad event. Maybe we just have a day where we're not feeling well, something goes wrong. Whatever it is, we have a day that sets us back and we don't get things done that day. And and then we go for a while without working. And then eventually we have another burst of energy and motivation and we do another burst. But that's not really a good way of making good change. Instead, consistency is about doing a little bit every single day, whether you feel like it or not. Doing it slow and steady, quote, wins the race. It's being the tortoise instead of the hare. And the truth is, consistent work will lead to success. Greatness comes more from consistency than it does from moments or bursts of energy. Motivation tends to be a fleeting feeling. It comes and goes. It's not easy to rely on where consistency over time begins to build habits that allow us to do things whether we want to or not. To be consistent involves setting realistic goals. For many of us, it involves finding an accountability group or an accountability partner. It's about starting small, not trying to hit it out of the park with the first hit. Instead, it's about doing a little bit It's less about the amount and more about the consistency that we're after. So setting a schedule, having a designated time to be working on things, making it a habit, creating a routine, these are the keys to being consistent when it comes to our time. Because over time, what happens is if we're consistent, we achieve more goals, we feel more productive, we're more reliable, we have better habits, and believe it or not, studies show that we actually end up being happier as well. I wanted to clarify, too, I talked earlier about motivation. Motivation is an internal feeling. It's something that comes from inside of you that says, hey, let's go do this. Inspiration comes from outside. 
inspiration is important as well. This is when you see someone else accomplishing something. You see somebody else doing something important and you say, I want to be able to do that too. Motivation and inspiration are both important, but consistency trumps both of those because consistency is going to cause you to work over time and get to the place that you really need to be. Now, earlier I said being consistent, doing the work, even when you don't feel like it. But the truth is it's going to happen that you're going to have those days where you just don't feel like getting out of bed. Maybe you're sick. Maybe something went wrong that day. And it's okay to take a break. It's okay to talk to someone and it's okay to even worry about maybe changing your environment, getting up and going somewhere else to see how that works. But the truth is the best way to break out of those days is by taking action. This again comes back to having that habit and skill of consistency. See, consistency is a lot like compound interest in money. It builds off itself. A little bit of improvement over time is more powerful than massive changes in one place. Again, it doesn't mean motivation and inspiration aren't important. They're the fuel that gets you started. But consistency is the thing that keeps you moving day after day, even in those times when you really don't feel like it. Thanks for listening. Thanks so much for listening to the Inspired Stewardship Podcast. As a subscriber and listener, we challenge you to not just sit back and passively listen, but act on what you've heard and find a way to live your calling. If you like this episode on the stewardship of time, be sure to sign up for our Stewardship of Time Tips series by going to inspiredstewardship.com slash time or texting 44222 time tips and that'll get you our best tips on stewarding your time. Until next time, invest your time, your talent, and your treasures, develop your influence, and impact the world.